Good morning, guys. It's Monday, um, January 27th, 2014. Um, today is another day. <laughs> very, very busy day. At least for me, it's going to be. So, um, it'll be interesting to see how it turns out. But for now, I need to get some food in me. So, wish me luck. I just be. It's a quick breakfast. It's, um, Kashi Goling Crisp Cinnamon Crumble with unsweetened almond milk. Yum. And I'm having some uh, cranberry uh, jubilee. I'm finishing off uh, one of my packages of it. I have another one in there. So yum. Hey guys, um, today is uh, a day to do working out thing. And I, I did work out one. Um, didn't do as well as I would have liked. Couldn't get my heart rate to go high enough. My heart rate stayed between 105 and 120 something. So yeah, my heart rate didn't get very high. So of course, you know, I was only in the zone for five minutes out of the 33 minutes I was working out. So I only got like 155 calories burned, which is not like the word, like the end of the world, because you know 155 is not bad. I mean, when I'm when I need 136 a day, so. Um, I don't know if I had mentioned it that I had gained some weight. I was I was 154. Well, I lost three of those pounds, and I think I I kind of figured it was mostly water weight, and I just but I had drank a lot of wa liquid, and I wasn't sure why I was still not losing the water weight. But I guess like day before yesterday, I finally got myself hydrated enough so that I peed it all out. <laughs> Sorry if that was TMI, but. So I, I peed out three pounds of water. <sighs> so yeah, now I'm 151, which is still higher than I'd like to be. I like to stick around 150, 149-ish. Um, so I'm a, a pound over what I want to be. But that's okay, because, you know, I've brought my calories down to 1,200 again, and I'm watching what I'm eating, and I'm trying to sort of stick to the um, Food Lovers program again, which, you know, is where you combine you know, the proper portions of uh, protein to uh, fast and slow carbs, depending on the plate you're making. Um, obviously, sometimes it, I'm going to do a little, go a little off of it, but I'm trying to get myself out of some of the bad habits that I've re-picked up, such as uh, too much sugar. I've really let sugar back into my diet and I was eating popcorn and a lot of popcorn but it wasn't like the uh, the microwave stuff which is low in fat it was the fresh stuff so of course I'm popping it in oil and I was adding tons of butter so yeah bad habits bad habits so I bought myself some uh, Stevie and the raw, which I'm not going to use that for like things like oatmeal. I'm still going to use like raw sugar for that. But like it's good for like my tea because <clears throat> that's what was happening was I, w I, I don't count my tea just because it's like water to me and I've been adding way too much sugar because I've let sugar back in my diet. So I got a big thing of Stevie and the raw because I like it better as, a, as part of my diet. Uh, tea when I drink hot tea and plus it so it sweetens and it and but it doesn't have any calories and tea all by itself generally doesn't have calories either so um, there's that and I'm trying to drink more water again and I'm and I'm actually measuring out again because I kind of started got in a bad habit of not measuring which meant I was eating more than I should have huh. But you know, that's what laziness happens when you're not really trying anymore for a little while because you're frustrated and stressed out. I'm trying to get my, <clears throat> my, uh, what's it called? I'm trying to get my, my eating under control and my exercise under control again so that maybe I can feel a little less out of control in my life in general because right now I just, I'm stressed out of my mind and, and the working out's going to help with that. And just maybe I can finally get my own personal, because I have I have some dreams that I want to make true come true. And if I get my my health back into check, which it is fairly in check, it's just that I need to be exercising again. 
and my foot's starting to do better, so therefore it's getting easier to exercise. It's just hard to exercise when your foot is hurting, and no matter what you do, you know, even if you're doing floor exercises, your foot freaking hurts. It was hard to do exercise. I, I would try different things, and I couldn't find an exercise that didn't hurt my foot. So I finally gave up and just let my, sat around and did nothing and tried to watch what I was eating, but I, you know, I, I let bad habits back into my diet, especially, you know, hanging out with my boyfriend for four weeks. They had a lot, they always have a lot of junk food around. And, you know, Christmas time is horrible. The whole, and, you know, I'm not, I'm, I'm making excuses, but the, it's the truth. You know, I, I allow, I personally take responsibility for allowing these bad habits back in my life. And I'm trying, now, and then, you know, I, for the week I came back, I was allowing those those stupid habits to stay in my life, and and I'm finally I'm fed up with it. I'm over it. So I got the smaller. I even got when I when I got the microwave popcorn this time. I got the small packages, the only hundred cal. Well, they're 110 calorie packs, because I'm sick of my bullshit. I'm not gonna allow my bullshit anymore. You know. No more big, big bags of popcorn, little bags only, and if I want to have more, I can always have two, and that's 200 calories. I just have to plan for them, that's all. You know, skip something else. And keep it around 1,200, maybe slightly under, slightly under is okay. Just for, you know, as long as I don't do it all the time. As long as it's not like 300, 400 under, but you know, like... Uh, you know, 50, 60, up to 100 under is not a big deal in my opinion. 1,200, you know, you're supposed to eat up to 1,200. But you know, on days where I'm not exercising, it's okay to go a little under that. Um, but that's it for now, I think, so wish me luck. I have to do a couple things. Uh, today is not going to be representative of my normal day because I have to, I have to go and do errands, so... I'm going to grab one of the sandwiches, the chicken sandwiches, the Pierre chicken sandwiches, because it's, uh, you know, it's quick and easy, and I need to take a shower and leave soon, so it's, it, it's you know, sometimes the convenience, healthy convenience wins over, uh, you know, taking an hour to cook my lunch, <laughs> so that's it for now, hopefully I'll get these caught up soon. I'm behind again, as usual. Nothing new there. <laughs> One of these days, I will stay caught up. <laughs> but for now, that's it for now. So, Oops. as I mentioned before, a Pierre signatures chicken sandwich for my lunch. Yum yum yum. Good for the tum tum tum. I'm having a raspberry picky bar. But need you. I am now having a lovely yummy thing called a uh, Pierre yeah. Signature uh, Yummy popcorn time. Delicious, 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 delicious.